Disney Springs now partially back open for business. The shopping and dining complex opened its doors to guests for the first time in months today. And a lot of people lined up this morning to check it out. But as New Six's Ezzy Castro explains, there are major changes guests will see. Disney Springs is welcoming back guests today after being shut down for nearly two months. And already this morning, we saw a couple of families enjoying the big day. We're just happy to be here. Joe Carter and his 11 year old daughter drove from Lakeland to be one of the first people at Disney Springs today. He said getting here early was the right thing to do since he didn't know what to expect. There's a lot more, of course, social distancing. Uh, everybody has to wear the mask. Um, unless you're eating. If you're sitting down at a restaurant, let's see if I can show you. If you're sitting down at a restaurant, you can have your mask off to eat. Sky Six captured people inside the property before 10 o'clock this morning. Disney officials say capacity will be limited and guests will have to undergo temperature checks and cover their faces. And only third party restaurants and retailers will be open for now. When they did the screening, they just wave like the thermometer above your head and then uh, they tell you to come on in. I mean, it's real smooth. Um, there are a few announcements here and there. The phase reopening is seen as the first step for Disney ahead of eventually opening up the theme parks. At this point, though, there's no word yet on just when that could happen. Disney to us is uh, hope. Disney gives us hope. It helps our imagination. And while some shops and restaurants are open here at Disney Springs, the world of Disney won't open until next week. At Walt Disney World, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.